Guardians, welcome back to the tower, welcome back to Violent Privilege. My name is Hunter, and today we've got a huge unboxing video. Me and Adi are in the tower for the first time for this April update, and Adi's just running around getting a whole That's bunch of crap, boring. so it's my turn. I'm going to be using this 6500 silver that I have to purchase a bunch of these. I also have a sterling treasure in my Postmaster as well. So first, let's just acquire a couple of these, because we want to see what we can get out of it. Adi, you want to introduce yourself? You still here? Still alive. I am right? here. I am the scumbag. You all know me. You all know me. Yeah, so I bought a couple boxes just to see what I, what I get. I'm also going to take this one out of my postmaster. Everybody can get this one, so make sure you go to your postmaster. So let's see. Wait, you got one in your postmaster? What? Oh, yeah. I did not get one in my postmaster. Oop, that might be a glitch. Oh boy. So, That'll okay, come so, later then. So, Sterling Treasure Mystery Bag, so let's just decrypt this. It looks awesome when you decrypt it. Okay, so I got Yellow Chroma, Red Chroma, Blue Chroma, White Chroma, and Spectre Gloves. We'll look at those in a minute, guys. Spectre Gloves again. Waning Star and Spectre Mask for the Hunter. I'm on a Warlock, by the way. That's interesting. I also hey, you got, got the Sperm Ship. I got House Judgment Reputation. The Sperm Ship. That's what it forever will be known as. The Waning Star is the Sperm Ship. Spectre Gauntlets. That looks like Titan Gloves. So this is going to be interesting. So everybody, you're not going to get all the stuff related to... Ooh, Spectre Boots for the Hunter. Okay, I'm getting a bunch of Hunter stuff. Vector gloves for the warlock. Ah, Space Age Mariner. I got the second ship. Yes, you did. Spectre did you get the sparrow yet, too? Not get the sparrow yet, I don't believe, but you never know. I haven't checked my Postmaster again for the items I dropped. S35 oh, I got the Ianglo. I got it. Nice. I had to check my postmaster. Okay, cool. I got the sparrow. So we're gonna buy some more boxes just because, you know, gotta get that, that taken armor. But for right now, we can look over the gloves. So for the spectre gloves I got for my warlock, I ended up getting the increased melee attack, increased reload speed with sniper rifles, and activates chroma glow red, or you can change that. I paying glimmer destroy active chroma so I'm kind of liking this with red though so I'm gonna keep that and we've got let's see here we've got the white chroma glow increased auto rifle reload speed and increased grenade throw distance and also impact induction We've got another white chroma glow with the sniper rifles and melee increased speed. So not sure what I'm going to keep on those. Now let's go to the Hunter Spectre Mask. I ended up getting more super energy for non-guardian kills, gains bonus melee energy on orb pickups, and the active white chroma, along with do do, do heavy lifting. So. Okay, increased super energy gain for killing minions of the darkness, and then gains bonus super energy from heavy weapon kills of minions of the darkness. Which is, that's interesting. And then I did get the Warlock mask. I'll equip these two, by the way. So you guys can see the armor. There's the gloves and the helmet. I get the boots. I got those for my, uh, for my hunter. And time to show you guys the ships. So, check this. Obviously, everybody's seen this in the whole April update videos. And then this ship wasn't really procured to show off. But this one is basically just the black spindle ship, except white, and it's got a white chroma light across it. So, yep. Space Age Mariner! Let's go. Let's do this. 
And I've got plenty of postmaster spots left, but I'm going to put some stuff in the vault so we don't lose any of the items that we get. Your new giant vault. My new giant vault. Why not use the vault space, right, guardians? Mm -hmm. So much vault space. So much. You're never going to run out, guys. Don't even, a don't little even bit. think it's possible to run out. This is, like, crazy. So oh, don't te don't tempt me. Don't oh, tempt me. Don't tempt me. Okay, so I can I'm run gonna, out. I'm gonna have to put some sparrows in the vault too because, well, apparently, you know, my sparrows. Oh, just dismantle well. them. It, you could they go back to your kiosk. Yeah, I like my sparrows though, and I don't feel like running to the kiosk, man. Okay, oh my God. so take the gloves, take the sparrow. We will show you the sparrow after the next unboxing. We'll go buy some more treasure. You deserve it. Over here. Give me the treasure. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Okay. So we'll do ten more. 30 more later. 30 more later. Um, probably actually should put some stuff into my vault for general. Uh, just a tip, Dim is not recognizing the Spectre armor. You will have to use manual switch. You'll have to put it in your okay. vault the old-fashioned way. Okay. That's fine. Him is being a douche about it. Okay. So, Crucible reputation boosts and House of Judgment reputation boosts, and we can just have those there. Not gonna use those right away. But let's start this next box opening. So, okay, Spectre Bond, awesome. Spectre Boots for the Hunter once again. I'm kind of sick of getting Hunter and Titan stuff. Ooh, looky there. Desolate Veil for the Warlock. Nice. Desolate line. Spectre Vest for the Hunter. Okay, I have all of the armor for the Hunter now. Desolate Robes for the Warlock. There you go. Spectre Vest for the Hunter again. Good thing they're all light level 3. Spectre legs for the oh, that 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 might be on that might be Titan or Warlock. I was confused on that picture. That's loot gloves for the Warlock. Yes, one more piece, guys. Okay. Spectre plate. That's Titan. Spectre legs. That's still. Uh, that's Warlock. And another Spectre Hood. But I'm starting to get a lot of Chroma, guys. Nine yellow, six white, four red, nine blue. Kind of happy with that. And we've got Crucible Reputation and Vanguard Reputation gains now. And we still have that House Judgment. So that's some more of that. Okay, so let's go into the Postmaster just in case. There was nothing. Yeah, there was nothing. And let's go buy some more. We may have something for you. Sure. Looks good. Yes. There you go. Enjoy. Okay, so bought another ten. Just gonna break down ten at a time. Just a little quicker for the unveils. Awesome. Bond of the Desolate. So I got the bond, and now I need one more piece of armor. I didn't know they actually had a bond. Didn't show that off very well in the uh, April update video. Let's see here. Back to robes for the Warlock. That's nice. Back to gloves. Gloves. 
Need a lot of Spectre gloves, guys. Lots. Spectre robes, yellow and blue chroma. Chromas for days. Spectre hood. Spectre legs. Got two more. Two more, and then I'll show you off some armor. Okay, and I only got red and blue chroma from that, so I'm thinking we got, yep, Postmaster. Postmaster's full. What did we get? We ended up getting Spectre robes again. Okay, so. Let's show you guys the armor. Okay, guys, so basically there's a Spectre hood that we ended up having. The gauntlets for the Spectre will end up putting on the robes as well it would load there we go there's the robes and then we can also put on the specter bond and also the specter boots and this is the specter armor set for the warlock without any chromas and with the dead orbit shader on so let's take the dead orbit shader off go to normal and that's what that looks like looks nice but let's look at a cryptographic a little bit because everybody knows I like the cryptographic shader. There it is. Nice. Look, red robes with the gold mask. A little bit of gold on the gloves. I like that. Now let's go to the Queen's Web because we all know PoE is a big thing in this update. So Queen's Web shader. That looks really nice too. Not too much of a glow like it used to have. I'm, I'm kind of okay with it on this armor set. It was too bright before. And then the infinite link if you guys shared an account with a friend to level up. So that looks pretty cool. And that is all thanks to Odyssey Grimwall for me actually being able to have this shader. And also the emblem. Created that one. <laughs> yeah. We worked hard on that one for a week. So let's see here. And I know you guys are wanting me to show you off the Desolute line, but I'm really hoping to get the other piece before I show it off to you. So, let's try and buy some more. Might even have to buy some more silver by the end of this video. We're not out of silver yet. Okay, so, let's break down some more treasure boxes. Sure, Bungie's just watching me right now. Now, right now, guys, nice things, scumbag. everything's going to the postmaster. Oh, there's the desolute boots. Nice. Glad we got I that in this it. video. I'm glad we got that in this video, and I'm never gonna have to really actually purchase any more treasure boxes. So, it kind of goes to show you if you spend about 50 bucks, you'll probably get everything. Let's see. Spectre gloves, okay. Awesome. So let's definitely put some of this stuff away into the vault just so we can show you off that Spectre line and also that Desolute line. I'm gonna put this away, I believe. Those are not mine. That is not mine. Bye bye. And these are nice, nice, nice. Okay. Now, must go and take stuff out of the vault. Day, and we don't have to actually take anything out of the Postmaster. Bye. That stuff can just stay there. Okay, guys, so this is what you've really been waiting for in this video, probably, is me getting the Desolute line. So, here's the veil, the gloves, the chest, the boots, and also that class item. And that class item also looks like the Dreg's Enmity that you get from PoE, just a Taken version. Just to let you guys know that. And all of the armor all looks like the PoE armor. So, just, again, a Taken version. But now we have something that we can actually go and get and acquire. Which is cool, because look, we've actually got a little icon above Tess Everest. And since we have all the armor on, we 
can actually get this, but it's not allowing me to grab it for some reason, Adi. No, you can't grab that one. It's not letting me. Uh, do you have an you have Let's an see. emote slot open? Emotes, probably not. Actually, to be honest with you. Nope. Way to go. Wow, I I'm gonna put the face palm on just to use it now. You. <laughs> Face, face you palm deserve the on. face palm for face that. Face palm. Face palm. You deserve the face palm for that one. I deserve the face palm. Okay, so there we go, guys. Look at that. Taking shiver. Taking shiver. Nah. We will be buying did these you need the, also Did later. you need the ape for that too, or did you just need the armor? You know how to get silver, right? I needed the... I needed the bond Last and item the boot. Too. Yep, I needed all five pieces. Look at that. Nice. Look at that. Now we're gonna put the Taken Jitter on. This is Adi's. This is definitely Adi's freaking emote right here. What the audio with that one? That's awesome. Now we need a gun to go on our back because yeah. This this one this one guy is just like looking at my armor like, wow, he's already got it. What what what? How's he already have it? <laughs> How did you already have what? Huh? The one, the one Titan walked up to be like, wait a minute, I'm gonna look at this guy. What? He's got the armor already? Just staring at me. The way like, you have it is by buying this shit. You can max out at three a week if you don't buy it. Yeah. You're not gonna have it for 16 weeks if you don't. To be honest. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. This is the unboxing video of all of my treasure boxes with the 61, 62, 61, yeah, 6100 silver. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and me and Odyssey Grimwall will see you in the next video. Like, comment, and subscribe to the channel for future content like this, and I'll see you guys next time. Ooh.